Hey, it's me, the Toys here, and I'm back here again with more Alan Wake. Hopefully, you guys enjoy your day, night, evening. And we are back. I oh, boy, here we I go. I should have gone to the cops. This wasn't the smartest thing I'd ever done, but I was still angry with Barry for trying to talk me out of it. These people had called me right in the sheriff's station. Oops. The cops wouldn't scare them, and they had Alice. All right. I have to go to Lover's Peak. Is this not Lover's? Excuse yourself. All right then. I don't like that freaky noise I just heard. the show folks as promised our very own dr nelson has just parked his rear end in the studio doc what's your deer fest plan like my plan you make it sound a lot more organized than i ever seem to manage <laughs> you guys saw that right <laughs> no plan really just taking the out. Race for us older gentlemen, huh? <laughs> yes, exactly. Fact. But I'm gonna check. Bro, out what the fuck? No, 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 no. We're, we're getting the fuck out of here. Oh, no, no, no. I don't like that. Why are you moving? Has it, huh? Oh, great. Nope. Yeah, I know we never speak, but... Switch doesn't work, so nothing in there. The Twilight Zone is playing. Crime and punishment. The cancer and cure of civilization. But some crimes are impossible to punish, especially in Night Springs. So, okay, no, let's not do that. What is that that I'm hearing? Alright. Manuscript, oh boy, here we go. Pick it up, please, and start talking, Mr. Allen. The air in the visitor center was heavy with an awful smell, as if some rotten <coughs> drowned thing had crawled up from Eels. its grave. Rusty kept coughing blood. My eyes were drawn to the twisted shape of his broken leg. The attack had been vicious. Max whined in his cage. Rusty's eyes were wild with fear and terror. He gasped. Mr. Wake, it happened just the way it was on that page. Bro, what? I guess we can do a little detour here. Do not feed a while, okay? Well, there's something here too. Another manuscript? Rose knew that Rusty was in love with her, and she liked what? him too. She liked him a lot. He taught her to dance, and life had certainly taught her the value of a man who was gentle. He treated her well. Made her smile. Made Jesus her feel Christ. good. But Rusty wasn't the prince of her dreams, and that tended to underline the unbearable truth. She was no closer to that Hollywood magic than he was. Oh, 
Okay then. It pays off to explore, but... No, you're not jumping over there, Mr. Allen. I can see why uh, they're making a second game of this, because it is insane. This is insane, alright. Alright, visitor center. Oh, great. Visions. The vision left me weak. This was no head injury. No! What the fuck? Second win in, we need to run. Can you hear me? Anyone? Please help! Hello? I'm back here. I'm back here. Hey. Oh my. He's like the page sick. <laughs> oh hell. It happened. Just the way it was on that page. I found. Game true. It knew. So dark. It'll come back for me. You must... The lights. In the office. I, I have the key. Okay, Rusty. Hang on. I'll be right back. Whatever did this couldn't be far. Rusty had found a page from the manuscript. It would help me understand what had happened. Where the fuck? Yeah, his leg is busted. Okay, need the lights, right? Where are the lights? Oh. The only way to make sure that Rusty was safe was to get the power running and the lights back on. All right. A manuscript? Oh, Jesus Christ. At the last instant, I changed direction and threw myself down. The axe splintered the trunk of a tree. I stumbled into the pool of bright light. My lungs burned. I was too exhausted to move. I tensed as I waited for the killing blow, but it never came. I raised my head. Nothing moved in the darkness beyond. For the moment, bathed in the cold light, I was what safe. What the fuck? Is the office? Only my revolver. Oh, great. I was too late. Someone had destroyed the circuit breaker. There was no way to get the lights back on. was covered with oily patches that looked like liquid darkness. Again, I've never played this, never seen any walkthroughs of it. Something had torn a mammoth sized hole in the wall. Wait a minute. Okay, no, that's still there. No, the dog! Please, 
don't feed the animals. Fishing is only for those prisoners who purchase a park fishing license. No way! At all times. Rusty, Rusty, no! It's never. I see him. What about the doggy? What happened to the dog? <coughs> Say less. Say less. I need to reload anyway. If you guys are enjoying this, remember to leave a like. How many are you gonna get? Limit. Alright. Oh, not what I wanted. What the dog? What happened to the dog? Please don't tell me that's the dog. Actually, before we go, I want to explore the town a little bit before we go there. Because that way... Excuse yourself? <laughs> that, uh, to see if we didn't miss anything. Uh, coffee mug, more manuscripts. But this game has a narrative, right? We have to try and... See, look at that. Look at that. I missed this. The visitor center was sturdy, but the impact turned the front of the building into splinters. Rusty was thrown across the lobby like a rag doll and hit the far wall hard. It didn't hurt until he tried to move and saw his leg bend the wrong way. Felt the broken rib stabbing him on the Oof. inside. Rusty howled in pain and fear, suddenly afraid to die alone. Fucking A, Rusty. Alright, let's check one more time. This is locked, right? Nothing in here. There's nothing in the building. Alright. What about the town? Look at that, coffee mug. Give me that. Okay. Nothing there. This where I came from? I think it is. Yeah, let's just like double check the back of it. Yeah, that's pretty much it, for, I think, for the town. Oh, wait a minute. 
That's not something glowing. Will it just be my flashlight? Yeah. Alright, let's continue on. Alan, do you need a break? <gasps> really? Who would have known that electricity would hurt? Alright. Yes, we'll go into the wherever that big monster is. Hopefully it's not a doggy. Because I only have a revolver. Oh boy, here we go. Checkpoint. Oh great. Well, there's the light. I can heal me. Thank you. Can go over there, so. Forget about it, Barry. It's just me going crazy. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. You're not crazy. I wish you were crazy, but you're not crazy. Ow, be careful. Stay in the cabin. Don't open the door for anyone. I mean it. Great. Even my, our friend Barry is, is seeing our shit. Manuscript? Oh, great. In that last instant of consciousness, Rusty thought about Rose. He was older than she was. Rose was barely out of teens. But she made him feel young and forget what a train wreck his long dead marriage had been. He still wore the ring. He'd been waiting for her to tell him to take it off. Now she never was. Jesus Christ. What the fuck? He never speaks that way. What? What's over here? Oh, it's just a uh, lookout. You know, I meant to see where Alan Wake takes place to see if this is real you know <laughs> I don't know why but I want it what is that a broken path maybe seems like it yeah let's continue on what's inside here batteries I gotta max out on those. For your own safety, huh? Oh. Safety's been like turn out the window in this game. Run, 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 don't trust the bridge. Lover's Peak was at the far end of the nature trail. There's something over here though. Where is this taking me? Oh, goody, I, I love those. Moonshine Crab Cave. Nice. Oh, I saw that. This case was the site of frequent and lucrative bootleggers activated to the prohibition. It was not like the research. Interesting. Nice little knowledge there. I hear walking. Ooh. So, give me that shotgun. Thank you very much. And a flare gun and ammo. Say less, please. Lithium battery. Alright, I don't know what's giving me these, these weapons, but I enjoy it. Thank you. Good thing we explored. That way we got a fighting chance. I got a shotgun, baby. And a flare gun. Oh, oh. Back to the revolver. Thank you. Uh, 
All right, where is the, uh... All right, we're going this way. Great, lovely. What? Jesus Christ. Did not expect that, that's for sure. Okay, where the heck are we going? Straight over here. Nope. <laughs> No, it is kind of hard to figure out where I'm supposed to be going. <laughs> I know the mini map is right there, but sometimes it's hard. Run, run, run! Don't trust this bridge. Yeah, take a breather. Checkpoint we shall wait. What is that? But it's up here. We're going in circles. Manuscript. Oh, great. Let's see. Nobody in Bright Falls seemed to know where Al was, but Rose, the waitress at the diner, had seen him. From what Barry could tell, Al pretty much fell off the face of the earth when he left the diner. Rose was just the kind of fan that Al hated, but she really tried to help. She was smart, too. Knew a lot about what was going on in the town. Knew a lot about Al. Even knew who Barry was. Barry liked her. That was no big surprise. When it came to women, Barry and Al rarely saw eye to eye. Okay. <laughs> so all that for a manuscript. She has this tiny little detour. But... Alright, let's... Uh... Let's check in the way Laura speak. Uh huh. Oh god, I don't like the noises. Shotgun. <laughs> Bro, what is... Why, what? I thought I saw something over there. Motherfucker. Really? The great old one. Oh, my lightning. Well, then. Here we go. <laughs> Is there anything around here other than the wind blowing? 
Oh, I hear talking. Oh, you bastards. Motherfucker. This motherfucker, can you stop? Fun, they say. Anything around here? Would you doubt it? Yep, I... Yeah, let's continue on the beef path then. Oh, come on. Oh, you saw, and I saw him too. You stop. Let's continue to the beat path. Do I only have one bullet left? Oh, great. So, where I'm supposed to go? This way, I'm guessing. Yeah, this way we speak. I need more revolver ammo, though. Because this is getting dangerous. the lights thank you checkpoint what do we have in here I'll pick some batteries some revolver ammo we should have more oh, great manuscript I turned the corner, afraid of what the flashlight's beam might reveal. Suddenly, a roughly painted symbol of a torch glowed in the light. Behind it, hidden by a rock, sat a battered metal trunk. It was here for a reason. Packed with supplies, batteries, flares, ammo. Things you need to make it through the darkness of the night. Something left behind by someone who knew what I knew. And more. <laughs> oh, great. Oh, I like the, the narrative. The story parts because it gives you like yeah here's a little spoiler. <laughs> no calling for help now, huh? I even I, I wonder how those payphones even work in a mountain. Where's the cables going at? The wiring, you know. Bear alerts, great. Got a flare gun. Guess I could use that, if anything. Thank God for that flare gun. For your own safety. There's another, like, camping thing. Alright, alright. This is all we don't do nature. <laughs> oh, speaks that way. Or was this way? Okay, okay. Coffee mug. 
Okay, turbo, I mean... What is this? The Washington Turtle was formed, founding Bright Falls. Washington was granted statehood. To be fallen by storm, okay. Oh, we're like in Oregon. I know Oregon exists. Ah, yeah, that's like the uh, the dates because wood. Uh, the thicker and older the wood is, you can see. Uh, one year it was from. Okay. All right, we're here. Lower speak. Here, why oh, is it blocked off? Who knows? Let's take a gondola. No way. There's just no way. Oh. Washington. Oh, fun. Well, I wouldn't trust anything with how this night has been going. Absolutely not. Gandala? Oh, yeah. So safe. I swear I fall to this water below. It's game over, guys. <clears throat> Shit. Yeah. Well, at least we made it. Come on, we gotta get moving. More of them coming. Who in the fuck? That flashlight's kid stuff. The flares will keep the bastards away. Oh, I do have a flare gun, you bitch. You can see them too? Hell, of course I see him. Come on, we gotta move. Why? <laughs> because that's the way the story goes. Yeah, but... Let's move! I lost my gun back there. Oh, I've got a gun. Just keep that light steady on him. It took a moment, but then I recognized him. He'd been on the ferry when I first arrived here with Alice. He knew my name. We were headed in the direction of Lover's Peak. There was no way this was a coincidence. He was the kidnapper. Come on, Wake! You better keep up! Bring it! Ooh. Oh. You have unlimited ammo. One more? Jesus Christ. Alright. Eat that. We load you, bastard. Thank you, POW. Lover's Peak, right up these stairs, Wake. Use the flares from the emergency box to hold them off while I get these boards off. Give me the gun. Yeah, no can do, Wake. Are you kidding? Give me the gun! 
The manuscript right there? Survive that. Better get ready. They'll be on us soon. <clears throat> All right. This is it, Wake. The last stand. There's more players here. Get ready. We fight them as long as they keep coming. Give me the goddamn gun. They're coming. That's not how this goes. Really? the aim, you know? my wife I knew you were gonna say that I read it all <laughs> you're a hell of a writer congratulations you're gonna write about something glorious and terrible once we get you some uh, proper editorial control what the hell are you talking about where's Alice I want the entire manuscript or she's gonna suffer bad. this dude you 
touch her all. Get the gun. What are you doing? Alan? because he thought it held some magical power. But I had no manuscript to give him. I had to get back to Barry and figure out my next move. Oh, thank God for this. Flare gun. Flares. Flare ammo. Yes. I'll take everything. Thank you, fl uh, flame things. Is there anything down here? No? Okay. <clears throat> I'll pick up a flare. Thank you. Oh, there's a manuscript. Oh, great. What is this going to say? On more than one occasion, Alice had tried to explain to me how it felt to be afraid of the dark. To her, darkness wasn't simply the absence of light, but something more tangible than that. It was something you could touch and feel. Worse than that, it was something with a mind of its own, something malicious and malign. For her, things changed when they were wrapped in darkness. They turned into something else, something foreign. And nothing was safe or innocent anymore. I'd never really understood what she meant, until now. Well, that's something. All right, let's, uh... Huh? Wait, where am I supposed to go? This way. Okay, there's the tree branch here, so... Let's try not to fall. Yeah, I don't trust that. <coughs> Excuse me. So we don't trust these logs. Especially with all the moths that, ha that they have. Get me out of there. Thank you. Now I feel safe. Bear traps. So, oh, dear God. What is this? First in an evil four? this a bear trap yeah you warn me about these traps I wouldn't want to get caught in one of them those teeth look uh, nasty these, uh, nasty or you think uh, where is it where am I going I'm a bit confused oh dear god look at all those bear traps That should be good, since they shine a lot. Brother in Christ, why are there so many bear traps here? That's gonna make it exploding a little bit harder. See, nothing over here. Just making sure. Pick that up. Well, I'm guessing I'm going this way. The fact that it's giving me ammo means something big is about to happen. Make it to the woods. It's easier said than done. So now we bear. Woo! 
Who really does that one? Motherfucker. Was one of them trapped in the beer trap? Because if I can use that to my advantage, that'd be great. Makes sense to reload every other time. You know? <laughs> Why would I think there's anything here? Can I put this? Nope. I just wasted a bullet. Let's try that again. We're gonna get ambushed, or is that was this just a? Okay, then you out. <laughs> Next time, I will use the fire gun. <laughs> Log. Kinda. Yeah, I eat that. Is that it? my checkpoint. Whew. There's one manuscript here and I think with that we're gonna call that a video. Let's see. The night had been one desperate situation after another. I was exhausted and my body felt as though it had been chewed up and spat out. The flashlight was heavy in my hand and each pull of the trigger sent a painful shock up my arm. But I was finally out of the woods and things were looking up. That's why Oh dear God. And with that, we're gonna call that a video. I guess we're gonna face someone with a chainsaw. Fun. With that being said, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter. And yeah, this has been Pimmy Toys and I am out. See you guys with a chainsaw, Pierce. <laughs>